Hey everyone, my name is Prototype. Welcome if you're new, welcome back if you're not. Today we're gonna talk about Clash Royale sneak peek number two. Now you guys probably have already actually heard a little bit about this because this video is going up fairly late in the day. They actually announced this sneak peek fairly early in the morning as well, so definitely we're gonna be really late on this, but I wanna upload it regardless since some of you guys might not see it anywhere else. So the second part of the sneak peek is actually with the rewards that you get from playing matches. The first part of the sneak peek, it says gold. Receive gold for each win, even when your chest slots are full. This is huge, guys. It gives us a little bit more of a reason to play while our chest slots are full. It probably will still ruin the chest order. So if you guys have been following that, you know there's like a sequential chest order from your wins. Now that probably will mess that up if you actually do play and get some gold instead of a new chest. But I honestly think it'll be a little bit better for those people who are trophy pushing. They can actually get something more out of it. Once they reach their new arena, they'll have a bunch of extra gold and stuff like that. So that's definitely gonna help out. Now crown chest contains twice as many cards as before. That's gonna be a lot better as well. Again, you'll have even more reason to play. You'll have more reason to grab those crowns and even continue playing once your chest slots are full. Now the super magical chest, the chance to drop is actually doubled, which is great. That's gonna help out a lot. I really haven't ever gotten a super magical chest from a game. So that actually is really, really good. I might actually end up getting a super magical chest now that they double the rates, but honestly, with my luck, it probably won't work out that way. Now both the giant and the magical chest got a big buff to their drop rate. That's definitely going to encourage me to come back and play some more. Right now, all I really get from wins is silver chests, and that's, of course, not great at all. So increasing the drop rates for the super magical chest, the giant, and the magical chest is definitely going to encourage me to come back and play even more. Now here's something you guys may not have expected from this update. It's something that's a little bit different, and it definitely caught my eye when I saw it. Now this part of the update is actually donations and requests. They increase as you reach higher arenas. So I'm assuming that the card limit for donations will actually increase, and the requests that you can do, uh, I guess the time will be even shorter I'm assuming that's what it's going to be maybe when you request you can get more than 10 cards or one rare I'm not exactly sure how that's going to work they haven't really specified all it says is donations and requests increase as you reach higher arenas now the last part of this sneak peek is actually something that we already knew it says in the card shop legendary cards will appear once you've reached a legendary arena this is really cool guys I'm super pumped for this I'll finally be able to get my princess and now that we get gold for each win that's definitely Definitely going to boost me up there with the higher chest rates. All of that stuff is definitely just going to help me get a whole lot more gold. I believe they cost 20,000. I'm not entirely sure if that picture was fake. I saw it as somebody's YouTube thumbnail. If you guys have been seeing that, I don't know. But I believe they'll cost around 20,000 per thing. That sounds about right to me, honestly. It's 10 times as much as an epic, but definitely, definitely worth it to buy a legendary. Now, a lot of you guys might be wondering exactly when this sneak peek is coming out, when we're gonna be able to buy legendary cards, when we're gonna have better chess rewards, and when we're gonna be able to get gold from all our fights. Spectating as well. All of that has actually just been confirmed by this legendary in the shop being re-added to this sneak peek. You guys see, when we had that March 3rd balance update, they did mention that in that update we would be able to buy these legendaries in the shop. I told you guys it was mentioned earlier, I had a video up about it already, and that means that this is confirmed to be the May 3rd update. So all of you guys are going to be able to play this in just two days, which is crazy. That's when you'll be able to buy your legendaries. You'll be able to get all those cards from the super magical chest and whatever the heck else they're updating. So that's all we have for this sneak peek, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully tomorrow we'll have a third sneak peek. Usually they do them in sets of three, so we can definitely expect one tomorrow. So be sure to hit that subscribe button if you guys want to see that. I'll be uploading it as soon as possible. Hopefully it won't be quite as late as today's was. So yeah, guys, like I said, hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you all later.